Hi friends, once again welcome back. We had already pushed two videos on Cowin 2.0 user manual and the other was uh, things to take care and this video is the live booking over uh, Cowin uh, portal 2.0 portal and I will show you how to register with your OTP and how to add members, how to schedule your appointment uh, with uh, different centers and also I will show you how to reschedule and how to delete an appointment. All this will be shown in real time live example. So let us quickly see what are the things has to be done for this and it is already started working from today morning and this is the URL you are going to click here covin.gov.in uh, this is the covin portal from government itself you can see here make sure you are clicking on the right link it should have gov.in and if you scroll down and as you can see there is uh, things like how it works so these are the steps we have to follow registration uh, and then booking the slot and vaccination and download the certificate you are going to click here co plus win okay this is the link you are going to click once you click on this link it will go to another uh, portal another web page where you have to register for the first time so let us think you are doing this for the first time so now click on the register button once you click on the register it just asks you only mobile number you have to enter the mobile number of the user uh, you have to click on the get OTP button here. Okay, I will show you there are some things you have to take care when you add members I will just show you those things. So I just click on a get OTP here and I'm waiting for the OTP as soon as you click on the OTP button you get an uh, OTP like this I had tried many times that's why I got more OTPs the latest one uh, you can pick it and you can enter OTP and click on the verify button this is the procedure okay so once you do this you can see here you are logged in by default and these are the uh, id proof you can select from pan card other card lot of options are there for example i select id card uh, of pan card and this should be of the person who is registering okay or you can select a person who is uh, say your father or senior citizen whoever it is okay this is the first person getting added and this is the registration so make sure if you are entering pan number it should be in capital letter otherwise you get an error like this okay i don't know why uh, but maybe they later they will correct it so i just change the pan number to capital letters now you can see it is working otherwise there was a red mark okay this is one point you have to note and maybe it is applicable for uh, other id card also now you enter your name okay example i'm entering here and enter the gender male or female and after that enter the date of birth okay here is the point this is the thing you have to take care i enter 1961 things are okay i can click on uh, register now there is no error no warning okay because 1961 person will be 60 plus now if i enter 46 also it takes so anything below 1961 it takes because you are a senior citizen now what if your uh, date of birth is uh, something different for example if it is 1976 so there is a warning here okay friends please note down this 60 years or older that means 1961 or earlier can directly do uh, register as you have seen previously okay when i enter 1961 it was taking but now when i enter 1976 that means that person is 45 or plus and in that case uh, see i entered 1976 and that comes under 45 plus category now do you have any comorbidities so as of now senior citizen or 45 plus with comorbidities only supposed to register if i give no here i click on register it is not working because they are not accepting registration from 45 uh, plus without comorbidity so if i click yes here and uh, click on register it will work because 45 age plus comorbidity will be taken comorbidity is explained in my previous video that means you should have more than one disease at a time you should have a medical certificate that might be asked while taking va vaccination so now I, I just enter comorbidity yes and because my date of birth is 76 45 plus and I click on register button 
it will take you to the website registration is done properly so once registration is done anytime if you log out or whatever happens next time onwards you can click on the login button here from the main page you don't need to do register again but if you have not added one person then you have to click on register itself okay in my case i had already registered one person so i click on now login and then again i give the same mobile number previously i had done I get an OTP, I enter the OTP and I click on verify button. You can see here OTP send successfully message will come like this. There will be a pop up, it comes for seconds. And now you have logged in. You can see here by default the first person I had added one person who was the user itself, who, who was uh, registered in this portal itself. His name will be by default added. Okay, I had given 1976. So you can see here pan, pan card also. Now you can add more members here. For example, you wanted to add your father or mother. You can click on add more members, add uh, uh, button and then first you have to select the photo ID proof. So this procedure is same. You can see here Aadhaar, driving, pan, passport, anything. So this is the same as the previous person. Okay, and enter your pan card something like this and enter the name here and for example I am just showing the example here and after this uh, what you can do say for example say I am uh, adding a senior citizen this time previously I had added 45 plus person now uh, select as male or female and after that enter the date of birth so only 1961 or below will work okay and click on add you can see here two members are added now okay one person was already added and on top the senior citizen person is added now but you see both are not scheduled that means we have just added persons we have not even scheduled any uh, vaccination drive uh, booking we have not done for that you can click on this calendar icon here okay when you click on calendar icon you can see here schedule appointment comes at the bottom i am doing this from mobile you can do from computer also click on the schedule appointment button now you are going to schedule the appointment or book for vaccination appointment center you can do it for any state in india there is no uh, bar no problem like you have to do only from your native uh, state for example i try for delhi okay after selecting delhi and i can see here all the other district of delhi it will be automatically coming state then district i have selected and after this for example say block i select a central delhi and when you click on pin code all the pin codes of central delhi will come i enter the first pin code and i click on search button so you can see here by default all the centers have already come here so you have to decide which is the nearest center or convenient center to you whatever center with paid is 250 rupees you have to pay after going there that means that's a private uh, supported center and all government centers are free and you can see here there is no paid that means this is a free center so if any free center is available near to you free uh, you can go for that no need to uh, pay uh, 250 rupees see a lot of free centers are available here okay so say i select one free center near me now bottom you can see the availability will come march 1st to march 7 availability is th there so by default for March 1st I have availability now 9 am to 5 pm otherwise you have to click next week bottom and then go to next. So here availability is there total 50 will be there by default I think already 2 are booked. So that's why 48 is shown here and you have option for March 1st I am selecting you have option only to select for noon on or afternoon you cannot select our basis. So it is like if you are going in the morning session select for noon if you are going in the afternoon session say, say uh, afternoon and after this while selecting you are going to click on the book okay when you select uh, click on the book option it will ask you for the confirmation okay it is asking it is uh, please verify the details because center date and time should be as per your convenience what you are looking for now uh, in my example march 1st 2021 and 9 am to 5 pm afternoon i prefer okay so this is right one now you can click on the confirm button i am booking only for one person so his name will be shown here i had added two members i am booking for one so you can see here appointment is successful messages come and you can click on the download button here to get the receipt or uh, each e, e, e receipt downloaded i just click here you can see here uh, there is uh, appointment schedule uh, is uh, downloaded here when it is march 1st date 9 am to 5 and afternoon clearly shown and this was the pan card was the photo identity i had given that time so please carry this when you go to the center uh, 
read all instructions now you come back to main page okay uh, this is the page I had added members you can see here clearly uh, the status changed to scheduled okay that means I had scheduled and this person uh, appointment was uh, not scheduled so you can clearly see here for rescheduling the appointment suppose I wanted to change the day you can click on the calendar icon again here and you can see here reschedule appointment again do the same procedure if you wanted to select another district is also possible now you can change it suppose you wanted to delete uh, an action itself uh, booking itself sorry I am not going to book this time maybe later you can click on are you sure, sure you want to delete the appointment click on a yes button so that way uh, this uh, appointment will be cancelled if you only if you wish to cancel okay you can see here let us try this okay you can see here member was not removed but the schedule was removed and it says not scheduled thank you so much for watching please uh, write your queries if you have some problem in booking we can also help you out possible thank you so much if you like the video kindly give us a like here also please subscribe to our channel thank you so much